Welcome back to another beautiful day in Red Dead Redemption 2. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the Viking Axe and Helmet. We're going to head over to that general area right now, but look at this beautiful vista. We spent a night out in the wilderness with our handy dandy camp, and today we're going to show you exactly where to get these awesome items now you will want to get these to get all of your achievements in the game now we need to go just north of annisburg see where this forks out right here we're going to kind of go into this general area and we're going to be able to find the items there i'm going to show you exactly where to get them we're going to start hoofing our way up there right now but i hope you guys all enjoy this video if you do don't forget to show your support and smash that like button and if you're new to the channel and want to see more Red Dead Redemption 2 content and special items, make sure to subscribe. A lot of the times when traveling, I just find myself taking in this amazing world that Rockstar Games has created for us. It is stunningly beautiful and just incredibly detailed. I absolutely cannot get enough of this game. I'm sorry, it was you know, it was sunrise and I was going through these hills and I just had to kind of bring you guys in and just show how beautiful this is. Take some time while playing the game just to appreciate the sheer amount of work that must have gone into creating this. So I really seem to have a curse. People, more often than not, every time I find them, die. I don't I don't exactly know what's happening, but I want to check out this horse here. Come here, horsey. You look like you might be a pretty good horse. Let's study this thing here real quick. I love just all the crazy things we can find on the way. So this is a Kentucky Saddler. Nothing too crazy. But this guy, I'm just coming around the corner, minding my own business, on my way to get the Viking stuff. And this dude just drops dead. You got any goodies here? Oh, God. $1.75. Ooh, four gold teeth. Nice. Now, we have just gotten to the area where this is, and it's pretty easy to find off the side of the road. If you are following the pathway on the map south towards the fork in the road, you're going to see it on the left side. If you're coming up from the fork, you're going to see it on your right side, and it's going to be just off this little dip here and you'll be able to get the two items just inside of here you see this right here that's what we need to go down and just as we go down inside of this we're gonna find the axe we can actually inspect the site which is interesting it's an old tomb very cool oh we're actually drawing something up who were these Interesting. Who were these fellas? That's pretty cool. I love the journal. If you guys haven't been checking out the journal, you definitely need to. But right there, we can look at it. L1 to pick up the Viking hatchet. Oh, yeah. Now, we can actually inspect this if we so desire. Hold uh, for details. Let's do that. There we go. So, favorite weapon ranking 12 out of 59. So, the damage is pretty high. Range and accuracy. A rare ancient hatchet engraved all over with Nordic pattern and bound with leather. This melee weapon was found in an old stone altar in the Rayanoki Valley area of New Hanover. Lodged into a skull, this hatchet can also be thrown. Very, very cool. Now, while we're in this location, we're also going to get the Viking helmet. Let's go ahead and back out of here. And if you go just inside of here, all along the walls, you're going to see all sorts of skulls and stuff. Now, in one of these skulls, we're going to find, or one of these little nooks, we're going to find the Viking helmet, which is right here. Now, let's go ahead and pick this bad boy up. There we go. Now we have this instead of a hat. You have found a special hat. This hat has been added to your wardrobe and can be stored on your horse. Special hats glow when lying on the ground. Look at us. We look beautiful, especially with those mutton chops. Oh my goodness. Uh, so let's go ahead and test out this Viking axe a little bit. I'm pretty excited about it. And um, I'm definitely going to be showcasing some more of these special items that you can get in the game. So definitely make sure to keep an eye out on the channel for those releasing very soon. 
Now that we've got this weapon, we can have a little bit of fun with it. It is a throwable. Oh, the stupid guy spooked the deer I was rolling. You know what? Since it's throwable... Oh, yes! Oh, wait, come back! He's got my axe in his head! <laughs> we knocked his hat off. Uh, but yeah, since it is a throwable, you will need to actually retrieve it afterwards. And it'll leave a little golden thing on the ground so you know to actually go and get it and exactly where it's going to be. So it's not going to be terribly easy to lose. Just make sure you do pick it up after you throw it. We got a gold wedding ring. Yeah, I feel like he deserved that for spooking away my prey. I do want to see if we could kill an animal with it, though, instead of a person. I kind of feel bad about that. I've been trying to be really good in the game so far. But I do have to say, this helmet looks particularly cool. Let's see if we can get a little bit of a closer look. There we go. Especially with the mutton chops. Oh, yeah. So much better than the hat that we had. And um, let's see if we can find another deer. I wonder if I could actually kill a fish with it. That thing? Oh, I did it! Yes! Fish killing extraordinaire! Come here, fish! You are mine! Well, that is a poor Sakai salmon. That is by far the best way to fish, ladies and gentlemen. Who needs a fishing rod when you have a freaking Viking hatchet? Can I kill another fish with it? You're going down, son. <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. It's not. What kind of fish are you? Come here. A poor bluegill. It'd probably be better if it didn't have an axe through its face, but regardless. <laughs> this is the best way to fish. Oh, there's what we're looking for. No, 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 no. Come here. Come here. Where do you think you're going? You're going to get an axe in the face. Come on, baby. Get it! Oh, got him. One shot. I haven't actually taken one of these things down either. I'm actually really glad. Murder for what? I did nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. I got So I got an elk. Can, we have my, can I have my hatchet back? Out of your sweet, sweet elk body, please. Maybe. You know, I gotta say, there's something extremely satisfying about hunting something down with an axe. <laughs> uh, I haven't actually murdered one of these things before. And I don't think I could take it with me. So we can actually... It's a bighorn ram. The axe doesn't like coming out of animals. I got it right in the booty hole. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a horrible way to die. I actually feel quite bad about it, to be honest with you. Oh man, can I can I have my axe back, please? That's just that's pretty much the worst way to die ever, I think. But anyways, there's did you know there's a hundred and like seventy eight different things in this game? I really just want my axe back. I think it's just lodged in there forever. This thing's got the... Just give me a minute, boy. Oh, it might be gone forever. Uh-oh. It like... Oh, no, I just got it back. Thank... Thank God. I was a little worried about that. But we finally got our first ram, so that was pretty cool. Don't mind me, sir, unless you want to get an axe in the face. Stay clear of me. That's it. Whoa. Whoa. All right, simmer down. You want to get axed, don't you? I bet you do. Oh, he does. He so wants to be axed. Got him! Did you get for being- Don't- Come back with my- Come back. There we go. Good oh boy. So this guy- He was being a bit of a douche canoe. I- I didn't- I didn't like him. Let's see if he's got any goods on him. What's in your pockets there, good sir? Ooh, health cure. Nice. Very nice. This is a big old fish right here. I want some of that fish. We can use this for bait too, which is nice. 100% undisputed best way to fish. I mean, you, you can't argue with the results, can you? 
Ooh, it's a musky, huh? Is that a good fish? Do we really have to tie this to the back of our horse? This is a big old fish. I guess the camp's gonna be happy about this one. But there are quite a few other things that you can get in this game by exploring extensively everything that this game has to offer. Now, I've shown a couple other weapons that you can get in this game, like the Skull Field Revolver and the Pump Action Shotgun, which you can both get for free. So definitely make sure to check out those episodes. I do have an entire playlist for all the special things that you can get in Red Dead Redemption 2. And if you guys haven't already, make sure to check out the full gameplay series that I've got going on for this. It's a lot of fun. We're doing live streams and videos, so if you feel so inclined to join in and explore this world with me, definitely make sure to check one out. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to sit here and have a little bit of fun fishing, but I hope you all enjoyed it, and I will see you all in the next one.